$970,000. Last year we were able to raise $953,000 and the campaign team this year feels we always should set the bar just that bit higher. So we've raised the goal to $970,000. So approximately $20,000 over last year's uh, goal. Uh, we know the needs out there. We've just been going across the county and we've done 23 community conversations and we're hearing how people are finding, you know, life is a challenge out, out, out throughout the county. So we know there's challenges. We've seen some uh, downturn in the economy around here, but we still feel that we have to raise that bar and try and raise $970,000. Community conversations given us the ability to really talk to individuals across this county. We've learned how much they love their community. We've learned some of the challenges they're finding in their community. And we've learned what they really aspire for in their community. So it's been a really wonderful experience. We've, we've met some incredible people, some incredible volunteers that do incredible work across this county. But we've heard about challenges in the area of things like food security. We've heard about challenges with transportation. Very lucky this year we had Dancing with the Docks, which uh, raised $50,000. So that was a really nice start to this year's campaign. Um, we've had a successful golf tournament. But you know, we're really trying to look at um, gaining donors, not only through gifts, our Leading the Way Society, $1,000 and more, but also getting into new workplaces and new areas in the county that we'd be able to raise additional funds. I'm really pleased to have another team to be our campaign chairs with uh, Beth Brook and Gerald Blackstock. Uh, Beth has been very involved with the United Way. She's been on our board for six years. Uh, she just recently retired. So the same adage goes, once with the United Way, always with the United Way, we were able to recruit Beth. And Gerald has just recently started working here back in Northumberland County. He was working in Toronto.